<laughs> Double header. Double header, dad and son. Dad and son. He's got a good one. He's got a good one, dude. He's got a good one. <laughs> there you go, bud. Look at you. That's a good one, bud. Is it a hard fighting mm. fish, bud? Yeah, yeah. Is it just me, or is this quarantine stuff just driving you nuts? Guys, I just like to be outside. Anybody on here like to be outside? If you like to be outside, give me a big thumbs up on this episode because it helps my channel grow. Not only that, guys, if this is your first time viewing one of my episodes, please be sure to hit that subscribe button because we have a ton of fresh content coming on the way. On this episode, we're actually fishing with my buddy, Jeff. Badger. We actually grew up in Fort Lauderdale together. We used to play hockey, roller hockey together, ice hockey together. I mean, I've known Jeff since I was 10 years old and now fast forward in life to adulthood. Now I'm bringing him and his son on a charter trip and man, we had a blast. We caught a ton of snook. This is part one of a part. Two. This is part one of a two series episode. Hope you guys enjoy it. This is inshore fishing for snook right here in Anna Maria Island. Oh, yeah. Drop that fish! Drop that fish right now! <laughs> hey, they gotta eat too. Huh? They all gotta eat. That's a dark well. Here we are in Bradenton, Florida. Fishing with Salty. Yeah, we're with Salty. Alright, buddy. <laughs> you can look towards it. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, be there, Be there. You made baby. Go, go. Oh, oh, oh. Yeah. Buddy, what? Oh, be man. You didn't catch a snook before I have. <laughs> Look at that. Look at Bee man <laughs> got got dad filming over here. Double the oh. <laughs> yeah. Here you go. Bring him right over here, B man. Right, right over here. <laughs> Look at <laughs> B man in the house. Here, sit right, buddy. Sit right here, B man. That is a big one, right? How's that, my man? <laughs> uh oh. You gonna learn how to hold them, bees? No. He, he won't. He, it just feels like sandpaper. Yeah, yeah. They're okay. just like they're the tiniest Look. little gripper teeth. Look. Trust me. You can feel feel right here. I'm not gonna let go. Feel right there. See? It's not teeth. Oh, it's not. Just yeah, so he like can hold sandpaper. on to his food. When squeeze you do it, you really just squeeze hard. it. Squeeze really hard. Okay. Daddy dropped several fish trying to learn to do that. Squeeze you squeeze really that fish. Here, tilt your hand back like this. And he might hold, shake his hold, head, hold but the bottom with this hand. 
Hey guys, yeah. Like Look at B-Man. Look at that boy. <laughs> Looks like he's eating your thumb for lunch. B-Man, is that your first snook? Yes. How about that? How about that? That is so cool. <laughs> is he big enough to eat? Is he big enough to eat? That right there is, that's a fantastic question. In fact, I would like to cover that in this video because that's probably one of the most common asked questions when we're fishing for um, snook, redfish, and trout. Um, that question is asked pretty frequently. So I'm pulling it up here right off the FWC website and I'm gonna read it word for word to you guys just so it's crystal clear. This is the most up-to-date information um, that Florida Wildlife offers. FWC is Florida Wildlife Conservation um, or Commission. Uh, what they do is they regulate um, fish sizes and if you can keep them or if you can't. So a couple years ago, we were affected by the red tide and the red tide killed off a ton of snook, redfish, and trout. So what they did with it, they shut that down. They shut, the, they shut down the ability to keep these species just to repopulate those species. With doing that, it's actually increased the number of, uh, of snook, redfish, and trout, but right here from the FWC website, chin release only area here in Manatee County. And this, this goes all the way up to uh, Newport Ritchie and all the way down to Naples, Florida. Catch and release only measures for snook have been extended through May 31st, 2021 from Hernando Pasco County line south through Gordon Pass in Collier County, including all waters in Hillsborough County. Since snook is closed annually from May 1st through August 31st, this fishery will reopen to harvest September 1st, 2021. And that's just a perspective date that they're planning on reopening is September, 2021, so next year. These uh, proactive measures are due to the impacts of the red tide in these areas. So with that being said, his question, your question, my friend, and I'm gonna answer you right now, just like I answered you in the boat. Um, your question, could we keep, is this big enough species to keep? And this is your answer. So a snook is called a slot species. A slot species is basically a species that you can't keep a fish under a certain size and you can't keep a fish over a certain size. So it has to fit right in those slot measures. The snook has to be anywhere from 28 inches to 33 inches. So it can't be less than 28 inches and it can't be more than 33 inches. If a snook falls within those measures on the time allowed to keep these species, yes, you can keep these species. Um, but right now they are protected by FWC um, for the purpose of regrowing the population. If you were in season, if we were able to keep these species, um, you are allowed to keep one per harvester per day. So let's get back to catching some snook. We got an absolute beautiful sunrise out here. Yeah. Oh, I need a freshie. All right, got you a freshie coming. Got a fresh. Here, hold this. Yep. Hold it. Oh god! Oh god! <laughs> He's a flippy flopper. Right. I'm gonna show you. There's a there's a little there's a peck fin. It's called. You go right underneath it. Okay. Cool. Oh, you go right underneath. There, right there, Jeff. Right in front of the boat. Right in front of the boat. Got Jeff and his son out here, crossing off the list on some fish. <laughs> back in town. The boys are back in town. I felt you talking about that. There we go, Jeff's on. First snook. Yes, on. Oh, <laughs> nice jump. Daddy's got his first snook too. Woo! Good job, Daddy. <laughs> that, <was pretty> awesome. <laughs> that is pretty awesome. Oh, he's he probably couldn't. How could you beat that, dude? Hey, turn around with your dad. Yeah. Yeah. Woohoo! <laughs> Reel, 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 reel. Reel, bud, you're on. Pull your rod tip up. Pull it up, lift it up like this, B. Lift up, yep. Keep hey. a bend on it, and that'll keep tension on your face. <laughs> Double header. Double header, dad and son. 
Dad and oh. he's got a good one. Well, he's, got a he's got a good one, dude. He's got a good one. <laughs> there you go, bud. Look at you. That's a good one, bud. Is it a hard fighting fish, bud? Yeah, yeah. Yeah, boy, Jeff. Look at it. Let me see, Jeff. Yeah, boy. <laughs> Nice. Flip him in to the side, to the side. Bring him to, bring him to daddy. Swing him on over. There we go. Oh, yeah, ouchie, boy. Ouchie. Yeah. <laughs> so cool. Are your arms hurting? Yeah. <laughs> Dude, what a fish. God, he was a feisty. <laughs> They're rocking the salty gear. Oh yeah. Yep, there you go. Hey, it's a, That's a good fish. Yeah. Good job. <laughs> Put both your thumbs in there and squeeze as hard as you can. Squeeze as hard as squeeze you can. It. Ready? All right. Oh, look. look at his mouth. It's like, I want to eat this fish. Here, hold them up. Hold them up. There we go. Look at you. All right. You want to release them? Yeah. All right. Look at you. Look at him just hanging out. Why is he Look at him just hanging out. He's all right. He's all right. He's going to realize that he's in the water. Oh, that was such a cool swim away. Good show, bud. Good show. Yep. Again, you just want to get that tension. Just so you know. And you can basically just lean in and start reeling. Oh. <laughs> that was so fast! <laughs> be ready, bud, be ready. <laughs> Let him wear himself out a little. I thought it was over the top of him. <laughs> oh, dude, it's too cool. A lot of action. Oh, man, they're strong little buggers. I think he's swimming at us. <laughs> yeah, he was. <laughs> well, it just didn't feel like he was on anymore for a second. Oh man, he's quick. Yeah, that was cool seeing the flash of the size of that fish flashing underwater. Yeah. That was nice too. Look at that fish. Look at that fish. Oh, we're going to get him again or another one like him. Here you go, bud. Here you go. You just be ready. I really hope you guys enjoyed that episode. I know I did. It actually put me back into a place, just memories of me and my dad fishing. Jeff, you have no clue how huge of an impact you are making on your son just by spending time with him on the water. He will remember it for a lifetime. Take it from me as an example. I remember dating back to my earliest childhood memories with my dad out in the water. In fact, I got some episodes coming up that we're gonna revisit some of those times. So excited to share that with you guys. Um, but not only that guys, I really hope you guys enjoyed the informative section of this episode with the regulations on snook. If you did, please be sure to comment that in the comments below. Let me know how you liked it. Um, maybe I can incorporate that into some episodes to come with, uh, with the species that we target. Hey, appreciate you guys tuning in. And I'll see you guys right back here for part two in just a few days. Salty, salty, salty.